Hey, JNM here, and in this one, I want to show you a new Blender 2.91 sculpting feature, switching objects in sculpt mode, which is an absolute game changer for me. You get the latest experimental version here on the download page, select Download Blender Experimental, and get the version from the 20th September. Here you can see the new features for Blender 2.91, select Sculpt, and here's the feature Sculpting Workflow with multiple objects. There's also the XYZ symmetry per mesh, which is great as well. But what I want to show here is the switch object operator to switch between objects in sculpt mode and the fade inactive geometry overlay. So let's have a look at this in my X sculpting project. By the way, the tutorials to create this will come this week. Okay, this X is made of three objects, the bandages, then the wooden handle and the upper part with the blade. And what you can do now is you can make a part active without having to switch to object mode. In the overlays, you find the fade inactive geometry option. I activate this and increase the fade value and you see the inactive objects, the handle and the bandages are faded and the other part, the active is highlighted. And when I hover now over this object and press the D key, it is activated and I can go ahead and sculpt with this now active object. And if I want to work now on the blade, for instance, I hover over it, press D and it is activated. This helps so much in the workflow because I always feel like switching the modes brings me out of my sculpting flow. It's a kind of small feature, but I guess I'm not the only one who's that excited about it. You can change the fade value in the overlay to make the inactive objects almost fade completely. And what's also great is you could, for instance, use the move tool to move the active object directly in sculpt mode. You have this overlay now so that you can see for which axis you are moving the object. So the only thing I'm missing now, perhaps Pablo is listening, is the possibility to add primitives in sculpt mode. This would be amazing. Okay guys, that's what I wanted to show. Stay tuned for the X sculpting videos that will come this week. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. If you have any questions, add these to the comments below. Follow me on my social media. Be my patron, this would be great and I see you in the next one.